Hi everyone. I want to talk to you guys today about commitment and God's blessing. First of all, God is never going to bless anything that you are not committed to. God is not going to bless a marriage that you're not committed to. God is not going to bless a business that you're not committed to. God is not going to bless a friendship. Anything that you are not committed to, God is not going to bless it. Why? Because God does not bless a mess. Okay? If you are in a marriage and you are constantly cheating on your spouse, you're sleeping around everywhere, you don't respect your husband or your wife, you're just a mess everywhere, and then you come to the church in prayer, and then you expect God to bless your matrimonial home, how is this even possible? Okay, the same goes for business. If you are always opening late, or you never open at all, you have every excuse in the world as to why you are not operating your business. Then you pray and expect God to bless your hustle. How is this possible when you yourself, you're not even putting in work or the commitment that it requires? It's like planting five pieces of corn and expecting 500 to come out. How is this possible? You put in five, definitely you're going to get five out. Okay, you reap what you sow. What you put in, you're going to get out. So I wanted to make this video to especially reach out to the church people. Why? Because every time I'm in church, I'm always constantly here. Oh, God bless this and bless this and multiply this and give us Abraham's blessing and everything is double, double and double. How? And then... When you look at their physical work or their physical aspect, they put in little to zero work, you know, to stand to back up those prayers. God is not some magical Santa that lives in the sky that's just going to trickle down blessing because you ask for it. It doesn't work like that. The science behind the prayer is action. You know, the Bible teaches us that first, that uh, faith without works is zero, Okay, you got to put in the work behind the prayer so that way the prayer and the work can work together. So, and then you have to put in commitment and effort. Again, commitment because being committed to something means is that even if you don't feel like doing it, but because you are committed, you have to do it anyway. So, that's why I wanted to make this video to reach out to someone that's struggling out there that cannot put their things together because of lack of commitment. So I really hope this video helps someone. Like, tag someone, share, comment. My page is open to all. Um, peace be a blessing to someone out there. Thank you. Bye.